Welcome to Simple Software Tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you two different ways to calculate fractions in Excel. So I got this problem from mathgoodies.com uh, as an example. So I'm going to show you two ways to solve 7 eighths uh, divided by 5 fourths. So the first way I'm going to show you is essentially using Excel as a calculator. So what I will do is type enter. So that tells calculate that this is going to calc or this <laughs> tells Excel that it's going to calculate an equation. So I want to put the first um, fraction in parentheses. So we want to do parentheses 7 divided by 8 parentheses. Now I want to do divided by another parentheses 5 fourths. So that's how it looks. So equals parentheses 7 eighths divided by parentheses 5 fourths. So I can hit enter and this is going to tell me it's 0.7. So 7 tenths. So that equals the same amount there. Um, when you get maybe more in depth, it's not going to be as simple as calculating uh, percentages that way. So what we can do is we can format the cells so they automatically display fractions. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select the area where I'm going to enter my equation. So I'm just going to select these three cells here and right click and click on format cells. So since I'm working with fractions, I'm going to select fractions. Now, we know that the answer is 7 tenths, so we want to select more than up to one digit because what this is going to do is it's going to round it to the closest fraction, which is going to be the wrong answer for this, this uh, uh, problem here. So what I'm going to do is just select up to three digits. That way, if we get some crazy math going on, uh, it should calculate properly. Uh, so I'm going to select up to three digits and click on OK. Now, in this first cell, I'm going to type 7 eighths. I'm going to tab to the next cell and type 5 fourths. And see that automatically calculates it to 1 and 1 fourth. And then now I'm going to do my equation in cell D5. So I'm going to type enter, or equals, sorry, equals. I'm going to tab over to 7 eighths. Hit the divide sign. I'm going to tab on to C5 right there. So see what I'm doing? It just matches up exactly how it needs to be done. And then I'm going to hit enter. So there we go, 7 tenths. So that's two simple ways to calculate fractions in Excel. I hope this tutorial was helpful to you. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more helpful tutorials. Check out my website, simplesoftwaretutorials.com. And have a great day. Thanks so much for tuning in.